The latest Tesla firmware update 2022.44.26.1. This is the major update for the year. And as we expected, Apple CarPlay is not here, but Apple Music is. So now you can stream using Apple Music. I actually don't know anyone that uses Apple Music. So this may be appealing to a small number of people, but it is here. Hopefully in the future, we might see Apple CarPlay and Android Auto to this user interface. Highly doubtful, but potentially. We have Schedule Light Show. So now you can schedule your light show to play. For example, if you want to play in sequence, you can set it up at a certain time and it will all start together. Climate control fan speed. You're able to adjust the speed intensity while remaining in auto. So even when you have auto on, it's not blasting the fan on max speed trying to cool or warm your cabin up. You can set the fan speed now. My Q connected garage. So if you don't have Homelink and your garage opener is using MyQ, you can now control it using MyQ. You do need premium connectivity to have this functional. Meijan, new game added. You have confirmed phone call transfer. So you can transfer between your cell phone and your car asking you for confirmation. So it doesn't automatically connect to your vehicle, especially when you're walking near your vehicle and unlock it. Contact locked up. You can lock your contacts now under contact information. Media controls. You have now more control to your media, closer to the driver for easy access. So the icon for this will be closer to the left, the driver side, that is. And you have emission testing mode by way mobile app. Emission testing mode can now be used from the mobile app. Long press any quick control icon from the home screen and drag the fart icon to the top. Now allows you to quickly gain access to this. Always rainbow, allow your driving visualization to show rainbow row when autopilot is active. To enable, tap the application launcher, toy box, rainbow row, always rainbow. So now you no longer have to tap down on your drive column four times. So these are the latest update with the big version 2022.44.25.1. So we'll be looking forward to 2023 in a few weeks. Thanks for watching. Remember to subscribe. Catch you all next time.